8 in the morning, the patrol receives instructions for the day's mission, secure Lyon city center. Patrouille pédestre de l'hôtel de ville jusqu'à euh, jusqu la place Bellecourt. Operation Sentinel was supposed to last only a few months, but four years later, these military officers are still the first responders against terrorist threats. 20-year-old Noah decided to join the army after the Paris attacks in November 2015. It was a shock for me. From one day to the other, it changed the way I look at things. About two or three months later, I joined the army. This is my first mission, Operation Sentinel in Lyon. When on patrol, Private First Class Marie does not go by unnoticed. She is the only woman in the group and has seen a change in how people see Operation Sentinel since the attacks. I get more looks because it's rare to see a woman in the army. People thank us for being here. It makes them feel safe. These soldiers walk at a pace of two kilometers per hour. Every day, they patrol nearly 25 kilometers in Lyon city center. They all carry the same equipment on their backs, weighing up to 20 kilos. Our equipment shows the difference between internal and external military operations. We have firearms, but we also have an array of other weapons to tailor our response to each case. There are, for example, expandable batons, that we carry on us, but also tear gas for the types of threats. A total of 10,000 soldiers are currently mobilized. 7,000 of them are deployed at all times. 50% of the soldiers are based in the Paris region.